Hello, everybody. We have Dr. Mike Bauerschmidt with us. Mike has been uh, treating patients, hundreds of them, since approximately 2015, almost a decade. So, you know, I'm thankful to Mike for being here. And Mike's going to take you through his tour or his experience with LIVO2 and try to put it in context with uh, hyperbaric. So, good morning, Mike. Good morning. How are you, Mark? Pretty good. So, uh, if if I remember correctly, you got your first Live O two back in 2015. Yeah, and you right around there. Uh, and I actually had bought it for my personal use. Uh, and the reason I got it for my personal use was because I was uh, suffering with a mold illness at the time, and I was my brain fog was so horrific that I would be sitting trying to talk to a patient. And I could not remember the last words that came out of my mouth. And then the complicated, I had to look at the computer screen to see who it was I was talking to. Wow. <laughs> and I swear to you, as God is my witness, after the fifth, just live O2 treatment, my brain suddenly was clicked on and I went, whoa. <laughs> just the ability. And that's when I became fascinated by the technology and I, I went out and bought uh, Dr. Von Arden's book, uh, Two Stop Exigen Therapy. You know, everything just made absolute sense. And as I, uh, as I became more involved with trying to get people detoxified and, and get them through the issues and the complications of being environmentally poisoned, um, it just became... The results I was we were getting were, were so dramatic and so profound. Um, you know, for the last five years, I, I've the my practice has revolved around treating the sickest of the sick, people that had been to not not less than five, and usually around an average of ten to fifteen different ologists, rheumatologists, neurologists, mm -hmm. psychologists, endocrinologists. Uh, cardiologist, pulmonologist, gastroenterologist, and nobody's been able to tell them what's wrong, uh, which is part of the issue with our, our system is if we cannot give you a diagnosis, we cannot render a treatment. And the illness that we see as a result of in, environmental toxicity is such that it is multi-organ, multifactorial. Our success here is based on two premises. Premise number one is the diagnosis is not the disease. And number two, it's always about everything. And if you do not deal with the total body burden of toxicity that we're exposed to on a daily basis, we're never going to get anywhere in the healing process. We'll just continue to chase our pharmaceutical tail if somebody can manage to put a label on what's wrong with us. 